Hey, it's me, Peachy, and welcome to The Witch's House. Now this is one thing I'd actually planned to play when my channel first started, but I wasn't able to to do a few complications. But now I'm finally going to play it for you guys, so let's get started. This is pretty. You're open at him, eh? Yes. Ooh. The way is blocked by a startlingly huge patch of roses. That is a lot of roses. I'm gonna turn it off for it. Ambience! Found something rusty and sharp. Take it. Got a machete. Because that's totally safe. Items are not used automatically. Start with every object to interact with it. But if I use the item from the menu, some items will have an effect simply due to you having them in your possession. Check an item description for more info. No questions, because I already know how to move. But yeah, I had actually planned on playing this when the channel first started. This <laughs> house. Out of the forest. Well, I can't go out of the way, can I? So, um, I actually have played this before, but I that was a few years ago? So I'm not exactly sure what to expect anymore. Oh, my name is Viola. I'm 13 years old. Oh, cute. Mind if you go to her house, but just stay away from the forest. Hope to see you home soon, Dad. Well, Dad, I'm kinda in the forest, so... Oops. Cut roses. Can't even make a dent in them. Great. Off to a fantastic start. This way is blocked by a small patch of roses. Yes. The way is cleared. Yay. The machete broke. What was that machete made out of? Plastic? Glass? But no. I could have used it. For what who knows? Huh? What is it? Hmm. So the way out is blocked by roses. You gonna go in? Might as well if you can't leave. Oh! You are save points. I like you. You will come in handy. Ooh. Looks like this is the only door I can enter right now. Oh, I'll see that. What's this? What? Okay. That was weird. Seriously, am I the only one that sees that? There's something that floats up from the wall. I'm not gonna step on that because it's dangerous. Come to my room. Where's your room? Yo! Decided I'd follow you for laughs. And certainly, where the heck do you come from? The door! Door! Alright, let's leave. I want to open. Well, great. Bears in the basket. A, bit, a basket that has a big teddy bear in it. There's a little bit of room left. 
Ooh. Glad to find the other bear in the basket. Large clock. Time rushes on. Now I've gone marching in town. Which is that, I repeat. I was six, so no one played with me. My father and my mother didn't love me. Oh. It says, open when the house returns home. Whatever that means. A teddy bear rests against the pile of presents. Take it. Come, Teddy. You will have a... A present fell from the pile. You will have a friend, Teddy. Can I call you Teddy? No will call you Teddy. Alright, I have to interact with the object. Put it in a basket. His limbs won't make it too big to fit. What do we do now? What, do we have to cut off its limbs? I'm saving. <laughs> there we go. It's locked. A dusty old dresser, there's nothing inside. Ooh, scissors! It's a pair of scissors on the workbench. Okay, I'll change to the bench. You know, I was kidding about cutting the berry blends off. <laughs> I was literally kidding. Cut off the teddy bear's limbs. Got teddy bear torso! What? There are bloody scissors on the workbench. What was in the teddy bear? I don't like this. Okay. Okay. <laughs> I don't like this. I like a friend. Stuff the teddy bear torso into the basket. There's no walking sound somewhere. Great. This guy. I am scared. What the frick? You saw that, right? I'm scared to go back out there. I don't know if it's still out there. Cat, you saw that, right? <laughs> okay. No, I was seriously joking about the teddy bear limbs. It's, there's teddy bear limbs on the ground. Oh. Cut off the scissors inside our fleshy. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Door open. Fascinating. Fireplace. Look inside. Nothing but soot. Everyone loves soot. Oh, I can push it. Yeet, I want to go through the letters. Taste poison. Okay. I do what the game says. Sit over there. Strangely colored soup in a skull shaped bowl. Cause that's totally normal. Drink it. Really? Yes. Yeah. The yellow was poisoned. Turn the locking sound somewhere. We can make it viola. Okay. We said then die by bear. Bad by poison. So I met yourself, do not drink the poison, or else death will come. Death will come to you if you drink poison. Jeez, you freaked me out. Don't come out of nowhere like that. But it's happened before. Alright. The cook is busy, one to hand. 
Frick, you have bugs everywhere. Jeez, you know those sanitary pests? What are you making, like, cockroach stool? There we go. I helped you. There's someone invisible there. Oh. I'm busy, so busy. You want some help? Well, thank you. The invisible person grabs your arm. They push your wrist onto the cutting board. The hand is exactly what I need. Great! I no longer have a hand. This reminds me of another game. I'm disgusted by your human form. I slowly become more and more aware of your imperfections. I decide to attempt to correct them. I... Really? Now I remember there's so many ways to die in this game. But I literally forget what you have to give to the chat. So I'm gonna wing it. Take the teddy bear wings. Oh thank you, how's the needle handle it to? Let me show you my appreciation. Silver key. A book titled Dining of Your Scraps. Read. People of failing and wealthy classes have long enjoyed dining with silverware. But this is such hard to clean cutlery. No, buy you. They would hire servants to demonstrate their wealth. In addition, silver utensils change color upon contact with poison, making them quite useful. No common. Did this open? It's locked. Of course. Of course. Pause. Strange, the colors should appear over there. Let's put the key in it. Oh. Yeah, it makes a pleasing sound. It turned black. The key turned black in the soup. Heard no walking sound somewhere. I saw you! Fireplace, look inside. Nothing but such. I saw someone going away. I'm not crazy! I am I. Yo! Why? A table that had a vase on it. The wine! Wine bottle fell off. Don't think it's a good idea to walk on it. Chef! Chef, you still got roaches over it. Where'd you go? Door open. Okay, now I can't really- I should not have been able to try to see that. A decorative cat ornament. Gotcha. There you, you got me. Yeah. I can't hate you so much. It's locked. There's some small facts on the door. Save the butterfly! White butterfly. This game is so confusing. So confusing. There's someone invisible there. Talk. So I think these books are going well. Need some to tie them together. I'll come back and help you when I have something. Oh, okay. I'm gonna read the first one through. The witch has one. Keys do not open doors in the witch's house. Something else must serve as a key. Like a chair. Or a door. The form of the house changes based upon the witch's magic. Neat. A funny story. Once upon a time, there was a rich man who in a long cart full of treasure. His cart had broken down in the woods, but there came a passing hunter and his dog. The rich man pleaded to the hunter to keep his eye on his cart, to which the hunter agreed. The rich man went to get a new cart. Meanwhile, the hunter kept watch. 
I'd soon fail and the hunter would grow worried for his elderly mother still at home. So the hunter told the dog to watch the cart and he went home to check on his mother. When the man returned, he saw the dog on guard. So he gave the dog a reward for his master, a silver coin to carry in his mouth. The dog ran all the way home and brought the master the coin. Or his master the coin. But the hunter flew into a rage. I told you to watch the cart, and what did you do? You stole from it. So the master killed the dog. <laughs> that was a messed up story. Why would you think it's funny? Oh. A mirror. <laughs> Residence burned down, and his wife were found dead in the wreckage. Their bodies were found to have stab wounds, so it suspected they were murdered, and the building then set a flame. Additionally, only daughter Ellen, currently seven, has been missing since the fire. The police. Okay. What happened to the rest of it? I don't like this. Butterfly! 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 I will free you. Got a butterfly. What about this says? The spider has poor eyes. He can't even tell colors apart. Oh dear. Did I just go bad? It won't open. I just did a bad. I did a bad. Alright. I'm going to investigate this place more. Well, nothing inside. Nothing inside. Nothing inside. Nothing inside. Nothing is I. Dusty old bookshelf full of cobwebs. Nothing is note here except for that note right there. Barrel, nothing inside. Nothing inside. Nothing inside. Piece of rope! Take. Got some rope. That lady needed rope. Or I don't know if that was a lady at all. That ghost needed rope. I will go give her the rope. Cause she gotta tie books. Get there. <laughs> so I'm gonna focus on carrying things up and together. Here, have this rope. Huh? You're giving me this? Give rope. Thank you. Take this. Book of Death. Alright. Alright, see ya. Later. Thank you. Wait, I just noticed the stains. I don't like this. I don't like this at all. I actually want to read the book of death. Let's see what this is all about. Read. Am I scratching out my eyeballs? Ugh. Oh, what the fuck is that? Good thing I saved. Why is my head switchy? What? White cat done with wall. A dusty bookshelf full of cobwebs. Nothing of note. Thanks to lady with a parasol by a river. Small bookshelf, a book is missing. Ooh, let's put the book of death in there. Book of death. Don't read it. Put it on shelf. 
Yes, good glass plate. Got the lid of a glass plate. Okay, plate. The frick was that? <gasps> Not nice. Well, that's it for this video, and I hope you guys uh, will enjoy the witch's house. Like I said, I played it a few years ago, I was gonna first play it for this channel when I first started, but I couldn't because of recording difficulties and the fact that it wouldn't open. But anyway, I'm super excited that I can play it now. I hope you guys will enjoy it. And saying that, like and favorite if you enjoyed it, and subscribe if you don't Pokemon today. And I'll see you guys next time, so bye!